free kindergarten in our virtual open house. Woo! Hello Wolfpack community, this is Joe Alvarez, your principal. Uh, these are non-normative times, obviously, so this is our open house video. So over the next 20 to 30 minutes, you're going to hear from some really cool people about the exciting things happening in our classroom. Those are our teachers. Uh, so what I would like to start out by saying, first of all, is kudos to our community, kudos to our teachers, kudos to our classified staff from our custodians, from our noontime supervisors, our instructional assistants, to our front office personnel. We truly have a great environment because of those people I just mentioned. You know, as I reflect back on the school year, my, my first school year here at Woodside, I'm really in awe about the commitment, uh, the blood, sweat, and tears from our community members, our internal staff, to really make a Woodside a happening spot. Um, obviously, we wanted to have all-in-person instruction, we're finishing, we're finishing up the school year hybrid, but I fully anticipate a fall for all, meaning five days of in-class instruction. I'm crossing my fingers. You know, really reflecting on the school year, we still had our great fifth grade camp, thank you to Mrs. Rosa. Uh, we still had our student leadership, thank you to Ms. Benzler, thank you to Ms. Stevenson. Uh, we had a great product. You know, we look at our iReady data, we look at our Illuminate assessments, we look at those summative pieces and students are gr growing, students are learning. Um, that Wolfpack commitment is really evident in each and everything that we do. So once again, this is a 30 minute video of our open house. I really wanted the teachers to really illustrate the great things that are happening. Uh, I know many of you out there uh, had the opportunity to kind of listen in or see the great things that happen via Zoom or Google Meets. Um, that's a difficult thing. Uh, many of our teachers, all of our teachers, have put a great commitment into having a great product, and that's in having our best students grow and show success. So have a great remainder of the school year. Hopefully you liked this video. Thank you. Welcome to our first grade classroom. Um, I am here to tell you a little bit about our year and how much fun we've had um, working together and how hard everyone's been working this year so far. Um, so this is our virtual open house since we can't unfortunately all be together. Normally this room would be covered with projects and art and writing and all the amazing work that they've done um, that I could showcase to you but um, obviously unfortunately it can't be that way. So this is my message to you, the parents, and to um, my students, and I just wanted to say um, how proud I am of all of you um, and how amazing you've been doing with online learning this year. I know it's not been easy, um, it's been really challenging, but you've all been so resilient in everything that you've done. Um, I'm so incredibly proud of the work that you have done this year. Um, some things to highlight this year. We have Mr. Alligator and Mr. Snail help us with our online learning daily. So um, my boys and girls, you know who these guys are. They help us all the time with our learning. Um, Mr. Jack Hartman on YouTube. We love singing and dancing to Mr. Jack Hartman's songs. He's helped us with our online learning as well. And um, it's really just been a fun time with that. Let's not forget the 2,000 dojo points that you guys all earned this year and we had a class dance party on Zoom and that was a really fun memory. Um, we've learned about outer space, we've learned about the Arctic, bats in Halloween time, um, pumpkins in the fall, we learned um, gosh so many different things, leprechauns, we've wrote about rainbows, springtime and the plants, um, math, you've learned over 100 sight words boys and girls, over 100 words you've done so amazing um, so I just want to tell you how like I said how incredibly proud I am of you and how we should be really just celebrating all of you and your hard work that you've done this year so far I'm so happy to be your first grade teacher um, and I can't wait to see what you do in second grade and beyond so please don't forget to come back and visit me Bye. Hello everybody, I'm Ms. Fonzalita and this is D1 second grade. Um, welcome to a virtual open house. Um, unfortunately, usually we would all be walking around and looking at all the amazing work that these students have done and, and the progress they've made throughout this year. 
but this year it's a little bit different. Um, yeah, um, they, I'm just so proud of this class. They have shown so much improvement and progress and learning and I, I couldn't be more amazed, especially with doing this online. Um, it's been challenging, but, but these kids did it. They did it and I'm so proud of them. And um, I, I could almost be brought to tears because they, um, they've done an amazing job. So um, some of the things we've done is uh, Flat Stanley, we're gonna be working on a heritage report, we're gonna be doing a car challenge that's coming up, um, we've, we've got reading, writing, math, uh, We've done guided reading on online and they've just shown amazing progress. I love seeing them just moving up levels. It's amazing to me, amazing. Um, right now we're working on a play and they're going to be performing. Um, and so, yeah, um, we pl we're playing games, PE. Uh, We've, we've just done so much and we've done so much learning and I'm, I'm unfortunately we can't be here walking around in this classroom but um, once again I'm proud of this class I'm proud of all their hard work and all their learning that they've done this year and um, so that's it thank you Parents, I just wanted to welcome you to our um, virtual open house and say that the kids have worked really really hard this year on many different things um, our two big projects that are coming up are the mission report that fourth grade is doing and our state reports that fifth grade is doing so I just want to let you know that I know this has been a really tough year but the kids have really taken the initiative to try very hard and do their very best and I hope that you guys are as proud of them as I am. Hi, my name is Miss Stevenson and this year I have a K-1 combo class and welcome to our open house. I just wanted to say this whole year has felt like an open house. You guys have joined us every morning at home and the kids have been working hard every single day um, doing reading, letters and sounds, math, directed drawing with their sketchbooks, which they love on Fridays. We have Curious George join us on Mondays to talk about what the kids did over the weekend. And now we have in person where we get to play outside, do PE, work hard in the classroom. And I have my group online as well. And then we've been talking about our feelings and doing all kinds of fun projects. So thank you so much for all that you have done this year to help parents. I so appreciate it. I know it's taken the village this year and great job. Kids have been so flexible. So thank you for all you have done to make this such a special and memorable year, making it the best that we could. Thank you. Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Hutchison. Welcome to B2, our TKK combo rock stars. I'm so proud of these kids. They've been working so hard all year and so have you. So thank you so much for all of your assistance in helping your kids be amazing students and learn so much this year. Kindergarten has blossomed in their reading skills and their writing skills. I'm so impressed at their integrity of work that we do every single day and I'm so proud of them and I know that they're gonna do amazing in first grade. They are so ready. TK, we have come a really far way. We are able to cut with our scissors now, use our glue sticks the right way, follow multi-step directions. We know high frequency words. We've learned all the letters of the alphabet and their sounds. Our pictures and our drawings and our coloring, it has improved so much also. I know that they're gonna do amazing in kindergarten next year and I can't wait to watch that process next year when they actually get to come to school. So thank you again. I hope that you guys have had as good of a year as I have had and I am so proud of everybody. So give yourselves a round of applause. You, the kids, you guys are so awesome and I'm so lucky to have you in my class. Hi, 
it's Miss Caitlin and I teach the trail class here at Woodside Elementary School. And this year we've been on Zoom and then we started, some of us started back hybrid in person. And I'm very proud of all my students and their families for all the wonderful things we've learned this year. This year we've studied letter sound correspondences, uh, putting letters together to make words. We've studied math words, rote counting, counting a number of objects, and we've done several science units as well. Weather, plant and animal secrets, and force and motion. And we've also done some writer's workshop. So the trail class has worked very hard, and I'm very proud of everything that we've done. So let's give three cheers for the trail class. Hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! I'll see you next year. Bye! Hi everyone, Mrs. Davis here in third grade. Um, I've been really proud of how the kids have persevered through distance learning. And then it's been really exciting to welcome um, part of the class back to in-person. So this year we've been doing lots of work on multiplication and learning a lot about who we are, where we came from, who our families are, and also um, we'll be next up learning a little bit about the Native Americans of California. Um, we've done some really fun virtual field trips including going to the John Muir House um, and also um, Los Vaqueros, which is over near Livermore. And it was great that some of the kids were then able to go in person after we had some of those virtual field trips. Um, as we wind up the year, we're really seeing a lot of growth from the kids in their writing, um, in their ability to do more complicated math problems, and also have just seen an amazing leap in their technological abilities, of course, from being on Zoom all of the time. Um, so uh, even though it's been a challenging year, the kids have really stepped up and in general have done a really good job. Um, so we're all just really thankful that school's starting to reopen and looking ahead to next year and getting to be back at Woodside. All right, hi families. I am Miss Hicks and I teach third grade here at Woodside. Most of you probably don't recognize me because I actually took over for Miss Benzler just in March. So we have been super busy working on our hybrid schedule coming back to campus. It's been super exciting. We currently in our in-person class have been growing some plants. We did that in honor of Earth Day, which was actually yesterday. And on Zoom, we are doing lots and lots. We've learned fractions. We've done everything from writing biographies to learning about different dinosaurs right now and their fossils. We've been having lots of fun with that. So thank you all for all of your support throughout this year. I know it's been crazy being online and in person and just that transition's been great with all of you. So thank you so much and we look forward to seeing you in person next year. Hi, this is Mrs. Rosa in fifth grade. What a year we have had so far, starting out with distance learning and moving into hybrid. It has been a pleasure to work with each and every one of these fifth grade students. We've done some exciting things, such as Hour of Power projects. Students were so creative in what they turned in and it was downright impressive. If you haven't had a chance to see your student's project, be sure to ask him or her about it. We finished up a week of virtual camp which was not quite the same as in-person camp, but boy, it was really an exciting week. We also have been working for two months now on the state report, and that was an activity where students learned so much. They learned how to research, we really learned about plagiarism, they learned how to write a proper paragraph, an essay, they learned how to put everything in MLA format. I really believe that after this project they will be ready for middle school. We've read five novels together as a class. We have gotten through a lot this year. Coming up we'll be starting some mythology, working on poetry, and geometry. As a math teacher, I'm so excited to say that I think that the kids who have been really sticking to things and doing their work have learned so much this year. All right, thanks so much, bye. Hi, D2 families. Well, I, as 
The rest of us, we wish we could have open house in person and show off all the wonderful things that your child has done this year, but um, this video will have to do. Um, I just want to take this opportunity to thank you for supporting us, for sending things in via email, uh, Google Classroom, all those kinds of things that we've all had to learn. I know personally, learning all these new platforms and ways of um, teaching through distance learning has been a huge learning curve for all of us. So anyway, you guys have always done it with a smile. You've had super patient with us um, and with me. And anything I needed, like sending pictures of things, you were always willing to do. So I really appreciate it. I think we've had a great year. Um, I know we've switched to hybrid learning and some of them are coming in and some of them are home, but um, I think the kids are hanging in there, having a good time, um, staying positive, and I don't know, I'm just really, really proud of this group. And I'm proud of you as parents, and um, I'm gonna really miss you guys. So thank you for watching, and um, yeah, I'm so lucky that I had you guys this year, especially <laughs> in this experience. <laughs> thank you. Hi, my name is Lori Bergman, and I teach fourth grade. Um, this is my 21st year of teaching and the strangest year of teaching. So we have had quite a roller coaster, um, but it's worked out. I'm really super proud of my students, uh, even though they have had to deal with Zooming and um, hybrid and power outages for their computers and connectivity issues. Um, and learning really without the direct instruction that I like to give, they have done an amazing job. Uh, there's been tons of growth this year that I'm really proud of. And my favorite part about this year has been the kids coming back to school. Um, so we have 13 kids that are back in hybrid and we've been working on our school garden, our fourth grade garden. Um, it's one of the highlights of fourth grade, and I think the kids are really enjoying it. They have been planting and watering and measuring and observing and just really loving learning how to grow their own food. So um, right now, they are also working on something super hard, and that's their mission report. And it's one of the hardest projects they'll do this year, but when they finish it, they're gonna be very proud of themselves. Um, and I'm gonna be very proud of them. So, uh, wish everybody was here in person, but hopefully you get a little snapshot of our class.